picture the scene. You're at the centre of a tug of love. Gorgeous men are fighting, vying for your attention. <laughs> you there, Cole? Can you smell it? Yeah? The cheap aftershave? Yeah. Well, that's reportedly what's happening to Cheryl Cole, which is a surprise, because, as we all know, she's not that good-looking. Um, <laughs> apparently, dancer Derek Ho and rapper Will I Am, his real name's Bill, uh, are <laughs> apparently going to fight, 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 fight for her love, allegedly. Oh, what you did there. Even that little tiny Justin Bieber has got a bit of a crush on Cheryl. This is a woman who's beaten him off with a stick. Could you cope with that level of attention? Should it ever come your way? <laughs> oh, should it ever come my way? <laughs> you were an international pop star. You were huge in Japan, Cole. I you must have huge had... huge everywhere, Kate. Yeah, and you were nothing to do with record sales. Um, yes, I could hope. I think I could really cope. Three men fighting over you. In your mind, in your dreams, who would they be? George Clooney would have oh, to be one. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> hey, they're on the side now. I'd just stop at that. I wouldn't get greedy. I'd just... George yeah. Clooney, George Clooney, George Clooney. Three of them would be good. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I'd have any one of them. No, yeah, oh, I... I, I no, what about, what about Johnny Depp, though? You know, oh. come on, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't kick him out of bed. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have to say, when I... I, I will say, I was 18 before I go with it. I was only 18. I was actually engaged to three boys at the same time. No, you so were. So I've been there. Oh, yes. Um, I, but I was 18, you see. I mean, you all do that at 18, don't you? You know, no. they... Oh. Got... <laughs> no, Sherry. <laughs> The thing is, they, it was just one of those things, you know, it's just I met one boy and then I met another. And then I met another and I thought, well, I like them all. So I went, yes, all right, thank you. <laughs> and so I did have that and I thought it was quite exciting. But now, A, I wouldn't believe them anyway. Um, and also, it's a little bit... Isn't it? What's that? I think it's... Don't you know? I think it's a dream. Yeah, you know, to, to be cool. one of those people where men just fall in love, you know, like David Tennant. Could you imagine if he was here now falling all over the floor over you? Or Mark Ramprakash, even. Okay. I mean, it must, be, it, it. it must be... It must be... <laughs> it must be a dream. But what is it that makes a woman, and it isn't always about beauty, the kind of woman that men just fall for? I don't yeah, know. What is it? Is it? What is it? Is it? Is it? beautiful from the age of four in nursery school. She's been getting those notes that you got at the start of the show of people always in love with her. And it's just, I don't know, people... It's a magnetism, isn't it? It's a magnetism. It's a je ne sais quoi. And if you could yeah. bottle it or put it in this cup and keep it, yeah. I think we could all have some my to share daughter, it out. But my daughter had it, and I think it's something to do with the kind of innocence and naivety which Colleen obviously hasn't got now. But, um... <laughs> she, however, she is magnetic. No doubt. <laughs> Things that attract men a lot, but um, they're just two things. But it's true. That would be your voice and your wit, darling. Yeah, there exactly. you go. Yeah. Yeah. That's what they're called, voice and wit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they're big and lovely. Okay.